The Lancet was founded as a journal, but it's also an idea to inform and to reform medicine. But The Lancet is also more than a journal. It's an instrument to accelerate progress, social action, indeed political action, to advance health, equity and social justice. So one thing people often don't know about The Lancet is that we employ over 200 people who are trained to scrutinise and analyse the science that gets submitted to the journal. My name is Richard Horton and I'm Editor-in-Chief of The Lancet. All of the editors here are working full-time uh, across over 20 different Lancet journals and that's an incredible resource of talent and skill to apply to the science that is submitted to our journals. You feel as a clinician and as a scientist that if something is in the Lancet we should be taking it seriously. So my name is Jessica Manson and I'm a consultant rheumatologist at University College London Hospital. So much of my work is about the impact I can have on the patient in front of me. If you've developed an expertise then you can help improve outcome for other patients that you won't meet by sharing your expertise. And to do that, you need to publish it. My name's Rupert, and I am the Editor-in-Chief of The Lancet Digital Health. An editor receives a paper. We assess whether the paper is right for our audience, whether they'd be interested in it, whether there's a clinical advance, and whether it will really have an impact on the field. When we determine ourselves whether the paper is an advance over the literature, we basically do literature searches to see um, where this paper fits within the field. We then get three clinical reviewers and a statistical reviewer um, to assess the importance of the paper to the field and to assess the methods used. So peer review is really the scrutiny and then negotiation with the authors about how to improve the quality of a paper. And we do it at two levels. Uh, we do it by going to external advisors who will comment and criticise on the science of the paper. We have a team of amazing technical editors and most journals do not have that group of editors who have the time and skill and ability to do that rewriting. So I've had several papers published by the Lancet Group and I think knowing that the Lancet has high quality peer review is validating and sort of sense checks what we're doing too. I don't want to publish something wrong, I don't want to have misunderstood my own data and I know that that will be checked by good people. They check the numbers, they do the calculations again in the paper uh, and that level of fact-checking is what makes The Lancet such a special place to work. And then our job as editors is to take all these comments, to assimilate them. We actually go to a meeting where all editors from across the journals, across specialties, they all have their own expertise. We all get together and we discuss this particular paper. We then assimilate all the critiques and take it back to the author and often request changes. So publishing world-class science isn't only about having great editors. It's also about having a great production team. Because the production team takes the words, takes the tables and the figures, and converts them into what is, quite honestly, a beautiful scientific paper. And they put the science together in a format that then allows proper reading and interpretation um, by our audience. Following the editorial process and the reviewing process, the paper is often much easier to read. And when I've looked back at what we submitted and what was published, the way that we define the message, explain the message, has been improved by that process. The result is this incredible scientific paper where the sum is far greater than the individual parts and that's what we're presenting to our audience. It is very personal publishing things because you see a problem, you see a patient group who are poorly served by medicine or you see an illness that's poorly understood with bad outcomes and you want to change that. Crucial to the change is publishing. 
I wish we could have a party every time we accepted a paper. It's years of work. It's a real achievement and an accomplishment to have a research paper that impacts lives in, in that way.